I see an increase in browning. The insects, you know, it's small, but they are increasing. Well, you know what? We've had we've got had several generations now. It it just it takes time, but it it works. It's spreading and it's damaging. Look at the damage. Yeah. Oh, look at look at these leaves here. Yep. Man, they are just feeding like crazy. Isn't he cute? <laughs> Little weevil snout. <laughs> look at look at that. Yeah. The damage is just great. Really it is. It's hard to find the weevils when you're out here looking. I mean, you see damage from them, but they're just so tiny and they're so spread out. You can kind of see the bullet ho holes, the shapes where it's eaten at the leaf. Mm -hmm. Let me see if I can find a better so one. adult damage. Adult, yeah. Adult weevils. Uh -huh. Okay. Bet. And then the larva will, will eat along the rhizome, which is in this area. And eventually the plant just just cannot function and it just drops out. But nutrient issues. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah, we, we amended the pond with hay and, and some acid, took the pH down, got it six or something. Mm -hmm. It has to be below seven. So the pH is about six. Yeah, the pH is about six, so um, a lot of the nutrients are available for the plant to use and it's just it takes off. This plant we get really good growth for our bones. Yeah. For our weevils. This pond is covered in six to eight weeks from just a couple of coolers worth of salvinia. The most problematic. This would be the problematic. Yeah, you can't get boats mm -hmm. through this. Um, canoes, any of that type of thing. This, you basically have lost. These roots, well, they're not really roots, but they're pretty long, aren't they? They are, but you know what? That's how they're getting their nutrients. These, you know, they, they suck it up, so. Ooh. Flat, okay. roundies. And the ones that go up. Okay, and of course I'll remember this. Okay. It can be a smarty pants. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna happen.